Well, here we are. Well, we appreciate your arranging this, Mr. Gordon. I know how busy it must keep you running a magnificent zoological display like this. Well, I'm very happy to do it for a fellow zoo director. Oh, I'm not exactly a director. <laughs> well, first of all, I'd like you to see the zoo. Uh, we'll have uh, one of our guides show you around. Splendid, splendid. Then we can come back here later and pick up our pan troglodytes. <laughs> I thought they were going to give us a chimpanzee. That's the scientific name for it, Dennis. Right, Mr. Gordon? Well, we call him Bobo. Will you step right this way, please? Oh, okay. See you later. Wow! Look at the size of those bears! <laughs> Magnificent examples of Ursus horribilis. Oh, I beg your pardon, sir, but those are Ursus minendorfa. Young man, according to Sir James Ellsworth's book... John. He, well, he's trying to tell me that they're Kodiaks, and I say they're grizzlies. They're Kodiaks, Mr. Wilson. Dennis, I happen to have read the book. That's what it says on the sign. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so it does. Now, John, don't you think you ought to apologize? Why? For having poor eyesight? <laughs> uh, Dennis, would you like to feed the bears? Boy, would I? What do you feed them? Bread, and we always carry some. Hey, he's good. Mr. Wilson? Yeah, no, thanks. I'm not hungry. <laughs> hey, he's good, too. He probably used to be with the Chicago Bears. Oh, Henry. <laughs> Boy, they sure have got long legs. Oh, uh, all dogs have long legs. Excuse me, sir, but... Uh, Flamingos. All flamingos have long legs. Just look at them. Aren't they sweet? And you complain when I wash your ears with a washcloth. <laughs> Sergeant Mooney on duty. <laughs> no, I was thinking it looks more like Henry after Sunday dinner. Who, me? <laughs> wow! Giraffes sure are tall! We've seen the bears. Ursus Mittendorfi. <laughs> Flamingos. Ponycopterus Uruba. <laughs> Lions. Pantero Leo. Tigers. Panthera Tigris. Now how about our visiting the Elephus Maximus? Or as we sometimes call them, elephants. <laughs> it sounds great, but first I think Dennis had better visit the Rumus Restorius. <laughs> Mr. Wilson, on behalf of the San Diego Zoo, it gives me a great deal of pleasure to present you with Bobo. I'm sure he's going to be a very attractive addition to your new zoo. Boy, sure like you, Mr. Wilson. Uh, yes, yes. <laughs> Excuse me, just a minute. Uh, on behalf of our... Uh, oh, that, that was my speech. You know, I think I'm going to like Bobo. Uh, well, anyway, uh, on behalf of our town council, I would like to express our appreciation. Yes, honey, you were wonderful. 
Oh, hasn't it been a marvelous vacation, dear? Yes, I hate the thought of leaving San Diego. Hey, look, the plane's here. Boy, that's the first thing I'm going to do when I get old. Join the Navy. <laughs> Form a detail and put Baker's gear in the barracks with all the other stuff. Aye, aye, sir. Hey, what happened to the truck? Oh, no, they've taken it away. This is the most awful day of my life. Are you sure you're all right? Sure, I'm sure. I'm having a ball. You ought to see the neat drilling. Boy, the Navy is the greatest. Don't yell my name so loud. I've just had a narrow escape. Okay, but I found your clothes. You did? Oh, I'll never forget you for this, Dennis. Where are they? I put them back at the barracks. We'd better hurry, because everybody on the base is looking for Mr. Baker. On account of the captain is plenty mad at him. That isn't all the captain's mad about. Let's go. Hi, Mr. Wilson. You're lucky I could see where that truck was going. Here are your clothes. Oh, never mind, Dennis. Hello, son. Uh, you see those palm trees on the beach? Yeah. Take my clothes and I'll make a swim for it. Hurry now, hurry. <laughs> Demolition charge is planted out there 100 yards. It's all set to go at 1,500. That will signal the greatest show of deterrent firepower the Navy's ever had. Baker reporting, sir. Baker? They flew me over from UDT. Sorry if I'm late, sir. Well, if you're Baker, who is that? <laughs> Search me. Well, I'll certainly find out. <laughs> the cat people. Now I remember. Cannibal. John Wilson. Oh, impersonating a Navy man. So long, Stubby. <laughs> Come 
back here, you idiot! You want me to get him, sir? No! You've got to get ready to set off the demolition charge in 15 minutes. Get into your suit. He's already in it. <laughs> Garner. I got tangled up in a lot of wires or seaweed or something, and, and then there was this terrible explosion. That's what everything. Boy, I'll bet the Navy gives you a medal. I don't want a medal, Dennis. I just want to get into my clothes and go home. <laughs> I wish you could have heard the Admiral congratulate me, Lieutenant. That's great, sir. Hear this telegram from the Navy Department. What you did makes our day even more successful. It points out the fact that the Navy, always on the alert, can go into action without even a moment's notice. Congratulations on a job well done. That's wonderful, sir. You know something, Lieutenant? That sneaky Wilson actually did me a service. Poor guy. I wonder if he ever knew what hit him. <laughs> I said I hate to admit it, that Wilson was a good sailor. I hope they give him a proper Navy burial. <laughs> it sure has been a fun day, huh, Mr. Wilson? Speak for yourself, boy. Yes, we were frantic. Are you sure you feel like driving, John? I feel fine now, Eloise. And Ted is out of trouble because no one will ever know how we got on the base. <laughs> Good old stubby stone. I'll never forget the look on his face when I spilled juice on him. <laughs> <laughs> Where do you think you're going? Where do you think you're going? Look, Ted! Say, what do you think you're doing backing out of there? Oh, uh, Stubby! Wilson! I thought you were at the bottom of... The bottom of what? Why do you, you back, back up me my you life just not worth a How did you ever get to be a captain? I earned my captain. You That's what I did. Who is he? There's a captain's insignia on the car. That must be Mr. Wilson's old shipmate. Captain Stone. You know something? There's always so much going on in the Navy. I can't wait to get old and join. Queen, right out of the world, my friend.